do I have to... I think I know what the issue is. Give me a sec. I think I know the answer. There we go. It's only set up to be able to be placed when you're on McCree. Do I swear this place looks a little different now that we're here? Huh. There we go, Velen. There's also some Protoss tech here now. Fantastic. It's all pylon floating off the side. Not all who wander are lost. It is a heavy burden I've placed upon you, Palanai. I have faith you will not fail. Con contains the vast sum of knowledge cultivated by the ancient Erdar. It is done. My heart mourns for the loss of Lura, but at least you brought her peace. Uh, once the crown is in place, the Vindicar will, sta will stand against the Legion as vile assault. And Taurus will fall. Will you join our cause? The crown is whole once more. Now we take the fight to the burning throne itself. Ready yourselves, and Taurus awaits. Awesome. It's kind of sad that uh, Arator has not really seen much scenes with, with the these people, considering, you know, they're his fucking parents and he hasn't seen them in since he was a kid. Or, I would assume, since he was r r rather young. So it's just, uh, you know, a bit of a missed opportunity. They had a bit of a talk earlier, but that we haven't seen anything else. Also, uh, actually, as a side thing, let us go to Dalaran. We'll continue the whole thing here in a bit. I want to finish my thing over in, with uh, the, the time walking. I'll do the uh, metal thing while I'm in Dalaran, but I want to do the time walking thing first. I'm so excited for Battle for Azeroth. New expansion, it's always a new expansion feel, you know? It's like you're leveling up again, you're seeing storylines, you're not being gated or uh, you know, grinding or whatnot. You're just going through new content, you're doing all fun new stuff. And it's really fun and new, it's bright. There's also this, um, like, Warcraft 3 inspired thing, or like, the RTS game inspired thing, uh, game mode you're adding in. It's like a 25 player thing where you're, like, building, uh, build, you're top, putting together buildings, getting AI troops, this kind of thing. It seems really cool. So, I'm excited for it. Though, as a side point, I'm still puzzled by how randomly burly this one guy is. Normally, all those enemies are more of a sleek fighter. Well, this guy is just, like, eating all the protein. And just, like, just, actually just roid it up. And so, it's just very jarring. Different note, it's just the demon there to the left. It's just very different. What, are people no longer panicking? Don't see any panic civvies in the streets. But maybe they just haven't loaded in. Yeah, it's just Dalaran citizens now. Or the Doomsayers even around anymore. So I kinda didn't even bother with that side. I only got a few other things. If they had a second achievement round, I didn't get them. Actually, I got the achievement first time round, but you never got to see the footage because the sound was off. I have fixed it. Um, I do have the stuff uploaded, but I haven't released it yet. I do plan on it. I also have some uh, pre-Legion videos to release, where I heard there was quests going in Karazhan and Ulduar, and I was worried they were going to be changed. So I recorded a playthrough of both. 
uh, as just to commemorate them, if, in case I did change. Uh, so I plan to restart at some stage. Uh, I'll probably stem uh, uh, one first, then the other one. Oh, we're actually going to talk to this guy. Nice. Uh, Arcanomancer Vidril. Uh, but yeah, I'll probably like do one series than the other. So that'll be at some stage. I knew that with a hammer and tongs and bang steel. It takes a master craftsman to weave the very essence of the arcane into one's creations to forge weapons of cunning as well as brute strength. The betrayer lives up to his name once more. What? Who's the betrayer again? Odin may have forced fate's hand, but bringing Argus so near to Azeroth. Oh. Uh, but bringing Argus so near to Azeroth has accelerated the reaction triggered by the Nightwolf's collapse. I believe the Legion's actions in Argus are further destabilizing the powers we've drawn upon unknowingly for many years. Uh, it is clear the further stories are required. I didn't even know realize half this stuff was going on. I'm not even fully sure what he's talking about. Oh, I did get five waking essences. They're off to once. There uh, must be in the resource tab. Currency tab. Yeah, they're here. Uh, we have to get 50 of them. But the only way I know how is to feed that quest. Which means we have to do that f for 10 days. I suppose that's not the worst of them. Alright, let's head down. Not really a fan of Stormwind's one, because you have to go through that from there, down here, then out, then you come out. In that in in Iron Forge, you just walk out of a building and you're done. It's like a shorter distance than, you know, from the where you teleport in to the portal. It's a shorter distance and everything. It's beautiful. Uh while it it is cool from a like a stylistic point of view, it is fine from there. It's just uh a case of I have to keep going back and forth that way, and when they have a fucking portal in here that it can use, it's just a little annoying to go the longer way. I got a bad feeling. Okay, let's see what. That's enough cabin for me today. Ooh, my quest logs full. Christ. Let us use this moment to reflect upon the past, lest we forget the lessons it teaches us, and doom ourselves to repeat it once more. And those were dailies? That was a daily? So if I had been here for the two weeks for this anniversary, I could have killed those three raid bosses. Each, th you know, each thing, got some cool gear, um, I got a ton of time walking badges. And let's do this quest. Good day. Can I do for you? Uh, let us test your uh, knowledge of history then. Blood Feather, Wind Fury, and Witch Wing are all types of witch race. Harpy. That's less history and more. Uh, genealogy. Uh, there we go. Ah, seems a. Uh, Dead Knight has come in. Annoyingly, uh, Anduin just says what. Um, Varian used to say, so instead, sorry, I'm trying to talk over the music even though it's only played out because my audio settings are too loud. Uh, he said in the quest thing he refers to um, the Ashbringer as a well, sorry, not the Ashbringer, but to Tyrion as an old friend. I don't think Tyrion is quite an old friend to Anduin, so it 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 just seems like they just transpose Anduin's text onto uh, Varian's text onto Anduin, unless there's something I don't know. You know, lads, you uh, may want to clean up over here. You want to clean up over here. It's a little uh, concerning. I've seen the Crimson Fen. Ugh. Go back to my wild playthrough if you want to know about the Crimson Fen. That place disgusts me. Basically, funguses were taking over people, and one guy started, you know, intentionally eating the funguses because he was being partially controlled by them. He didn't have to get the full effect. 
but it was enough to start him going kind of, you know, obsessed with, you know, starting his rim feast and just, like, eating fungus pods and shit like this. It really fucking uh, unnerved me. Because it's body horror -y and I don't like body horror. Alright. Let us go and deal with... Um, this stuff over here. I need to get some better gear for my followers, it seems, but they don't actually have any quests right now to get better gear. It's all just brings them up to 900. Just gonna have to keep boosting it up, maybe, from what I get from the uh, equipment thing. But then again, I'm thinking maybe he doesn't actually do any of that anymore. Uh, do anything that's relevant anymore. Um, I think it caps out at like 900, what he gives. Yeah, it caps out at 900. Though he does give some other stuff, like the straight stone axe, it's it dust, obviously. It's, it's, it's not one of those bits of gear. There we go. Train those two. Two traits here. Let's go turn them in as well. Can we get another one? No. V void purged core cruel. The broken of McCree were spared to fell only to succumb to the void. A few void touched have had their minds unclouded, but remain inextricably bonded to the shadow. Well, spoilers. It the um. During the PTR, they were saying that like every three levels is a. Um, they were saying that every three levels of the concordance of the Legion Fall, you get a. Um, you know, a thing at the other thing. The, you know, uh, light shadow combiner thing. That. They were saying that, but don't know how. Um, if that carried over. Uh, if that assessment carried over into the main thing, if you get me. So, 69, 63, and 66. I'm currently at 62. Some people have really grind grounded this stuff up. I haven't really bothered. Um, I'll send this off. Now, I could go and grind this. Basically, to do that, I would want to run all of these raids, because I'll get all one of these for each one. Um, and that would get me a fair bit of levels, even if I was only getting 2.1, let's say just the 2 million. Um, I currently ha only need 9 million, so 2, 4, 6, 8, uh, so 8 and a half, well sorry, five and, uh, 4 and a half. And I got a level, excluding this 4 million I already have. I could just say I was on zero right now. So, 4.5 and, and I got a level. You know, let's say, f you know, 5.5, I got another one. As in a new 5.5, not just 1.5 extra. Or 1 extra, I should say. So, yeah, doing, you know, doing that would help me. Then, you know, just running a ton of dungeons, uh, running a ton of random heroics. Maybe doing some mythics. Doing all that stuff would help me. But I'm not sure if I care enough. I'm not sure if I care enough indeed. Actually, as a side point, considering how much rep I have with the Broken Shore, I'm thinking maybe it would be worthwhile to... Um, to go... Ooh, we can go fight Brut Brutalis. Brutalis. That's cool. Let's go do that. I haven't seen him since uh, Burn Crusade. Um, maybe I should go and do some of their dailies. Might be able to... Um, well, I probably won't be able to finish it off today, but... Might make a bit of progress. Let's pop this. Let's pop this. Knowingly, I can only bless one person with these. It's a bit annoying. That's actually really annoying. This gets... Having, um... Blessing the Ashbringer 
makes this stronger, but to get Blessing and Ashbringer, I must already have the Greater Blessing of Kings. Huh. But I don't think the Blessing of Kings will retroactively get stronger for well, having that. Also, I need to do these. Christ. I forgot all about doing these. You know what? Let's do it right now. I think they also wanted me to be specced for protection. I don't actually have any gear. Okay, you know what? Let's not do these right now. Let us... I kind of want to do them right now, but I'm thinking, let's go... No, not this. Uh, we go to... You. Let us go to Deliverance Point. We will do that, and I'll try and do it in his, a video soon. But I'm not. I'm not going to do it right now. I have a few other things I want to do. Also, actually, a few raid things quests to do. Like there, I have a quest there to kill Ellison. I have a quest there to kill the Mistress Sazine. I've also a few I know to do the uh, Karazan. I don't want to do them all before uh, the expansion hits. Because after that, I probably won't get to do them until I'm overleveled enough to solo it. So, yeah. And sadly, the there's going to be a stat crunch coming soon. Well, like in the expansion. So, I'm not going to have... Um, You know, this much health, I won't be doing a few million hit points or half a million hit points of damage anymore. So it's a bit disappointing, but still, a Take that buff. And this was. If you fill your bonus roll on the Broken Isles, you have a chance that you'll have the thing refunded. So if we just fund that. Beautiful. Got four of these. Sadly, we no longer get those treasure packs anymore. Those were nearly worth a billion each. That's quite fantastic. Oh, that's weird. Some Morka Braves aren't part of the Army's Legion Fall, but the uh, Defenders of Argus are. It's strange. Nor are the Argus Purifiers. Or defender our, our Vargas down here. It's all very strange. Does this person down here do anything? Be uh, I know you can talk to them. I can't remember if they do anything. No, she doesn't. Okay, let's go over here. I think I have some uh, Nether shards. We can go deal with that. Uh, I'm not doing with the Murlocs. I can't really be bothered. Here, uh, one second. Hey, folks, and I'm back. Uh, let us continue. Let me just make sure I'm recording. Zero, three, six, nine, two, five, eight, one, four, seven, zero. Yes. That, uh, there's like the frames encoded and extended amount of frames and it's typically going up in 30. Sometimes it does 29, but typically it's in 30s. Though when I start counting it out like that, I end up feeling like a fucking number station. Uh, for those who don't know what a number station is, there are like these mysterious radios you can hear um, online. Uh, well, sorry, not on... Well, you might hear some of them online, but they're over like uh, ham radios and whatnot. So, uh, you can go listen to them. Um, I was listening they're talking about it on Taverncast. They're saying that the t typical idea for them is that they're, um, you know, uh, messages to people. Yeah, you know, like to spies in the field or something. But no one knows, for, there's nothing certain said about them. Uh, nothing confirmed, like. So, yeah. But, to be honest, for all I know, it could be people pissing around. So, yeah. I've been listening to so much Tavern Cast. Um, just, I know, I've just been listening to a lot of them lately. Tons for the last bit. 
It's um, it's nice. I used to watch it a ton as when I was younger, so it's nice to be watching it again.